Hey, welcome to episode 55 of my Road to Pop Rewards series. So today, oh, I actually had a, um, I don't know what to call it, like a bug, a glitch, a hack, I don't know, like, <laughs> I announced it in CC and everyone was like, oh my god, reported, reported. Um, I actually managed to get this, um, if you can see anything odd there, yes, the occult, <laughs> occultist, I haven't even said it before, I guess I haven't had it, that's it, um, I got that yesterday, and I'm only 83 runecrafting, which is crazy. Like, how the hell did I get that in my ports? It was just like the daily reset. As you can see here, there's the um, top there. It's the Oculus and the visitors, and then as you can see in the stats there, 83 runecrafting. So I don't know what the hell went on there, but I didn't actually get a story mission for it. The only mission I had there was what what was shown there. That's the only ones. There wasn't any other ones there for that day. Um, I did send it out. It came back fine. I got it. Like, I got the... Uh, got the 700 steel all, all went good it was just extremely confusing um i'm thinking the trio storylines have something really really crazy with them also with this mission right here i had that in the morning when i sent it off uh well when i had the so well i'll start again the when i sent the mission off the night before i had the uh convict for some the same day as the occultist and um i hadn't picked it up i was like returned it claimed the rewards and that until the two hours after the reset which was today now i had the convict in the like uh, adventurers ready to send off and i still had it still like out at the moment so it was like it was in port but it was underway so uh, i didn't send it off because i usually send them off overnight so i didn't send it off straight away and then the one that was sitting in the port disappeared when i when the other one returned so that's definitely confirmed the uh, thing that I heard yesterday with the uh, trio missions cancelling out all his uh, voyages, which makes sense. You had three voyages, out, all three adventurers out. That's going to cancel pretty much all of your adventurers. Three out of six of them, if you've got any of those three in the port, they're all bye-bye, they're all gone. So yeah, you might want to uh, replay what I just said then because it sounded really, really confusing to myself. Basically what I'm saying is if you have a an adventurer underway when you get the reset uh make sure you send it before you pick up the reward from the uh, the other one when it returns or it will disappear the last one and i don't even know what's wrong with the occultist i'm as i was saying before i think there's something crazy with the trio storylines i think there's something going on really buggy with them um especially the fact that i got the occultist uh, that's really weird it actually showed up as a fourth adventurer in my trio storyline we it actually talked in the trio storyline like with the one that doesn't even involve it which is <laughs> what the hell it was um which is interesting. On that matter, I did actually get a... I used a re-roll, like an adventure re-roll from a D&D straight after I lost that convict one. So, you know, like I still got to stand out my uh, special today and I actually got the trio. So I got the convict and the missionary, I think it was. I'll, I'll show you in a sec, um, me sending it off. But I sent that off uh, with a pretty good success rate and then actually came back unsuccessful. It was a bit of a bummer, but I actually had to buy a Jade Merchant because I dismissed my other one, but I ended up just dismissing my... Uh, my speed crew because I don't use that anymore. It's completely useless and just buying another Jade Merchant just because I can, I guess, I got all this spare. Then I really, really wanted to get the Tetsu Plate uh, forged for this episode so I could use it. And then I wanted to go solo some next, is, uh, solo next with Tetsu top and bottom and a red pea hat on. But, you know, it didn't happen. So I'll get that out soon. I, get that. I should get the, I don't know, I should get the Tetsu whenever the next, uh, trio storyline comes in but yeah it's a send off right there so as you can see 50 plate 50 lacquer just crazy um yeah showing all the other voyages there i just looked at them i was like i'm gonna look them anyway i'm not gonna do them like there's no chance i'm gonna do them but yeah so i'm pretty keen to get that storyline done that trio storyline and i'm actually really keen to get the other storyline in and see if i can do it uh with the uh, without the occultists through the trio storylines because I didn't actually get the option before to do a storyline and that's always like, you always had it if you haven't done it yet and yeah, like, it doesn't make any sense. It says on my ports thing, if you see it right at the start, um, it says that I've met every adventurer. Like, come on, there's something going on weird here. But anyway, that's it for the episode, guys. Have a good one. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.